Welcome to Team Wild's Carnivore. Previously, you saw L3 Outdoors' Joshua White take a day off from hog hunting to tackle a very different beast. Now it's Jeremy's job to skin this gator and harvest its meat. All right, so this is a gator that the main Josh killed, the one I had to go swim for. So if you ain't ever seen how to skin a gator, pay attention. All right, so you get all these scales, and the easiest way to cut is to actually follow them. Don't try to cut through them. All right, that's about as far as I can get with the silver stag. Now it's time to switch over to the sawzall. All That was the hard part. Well, kind of the hard part, if you know what you're doing. So, now we're going to cut up the legs, show you how to skin the legs, and then show you what meat is the best and which ones to keep. So there's the leg, that's your darker meat on it, but man, you fry that up, that's good eating right there, good eating. Alright, so now we're going to cut the, the foot off. I have to give that to Josh, a little lucky present. You know, rabbit's foot are lucky, just try an alligator foot. So there's uh, the front leg, nice pretty meat, sure is going to taste good, I didn't have to say. Alright, so now I'm going to show you how to do the tail. The tail has a majority of the meat, fry it, barbecue it, whatever you want, all tastes great. So, watch, or how to do gator tail.
hard to get in there with a knife. So it's easy to cut it off, work with the rest of the tail that you have, and then go back to this and try to get what you can out of it. There's your tail. That's where most of your meat is. It's on the best meat. So now all you have left will be the back legs. You just do them the exact same way how I showed you do the front legs. Tastes great. So that's it. Subscribe to Team RTV for the best hunting, air gun, gear and bow hunting videos on YouTube.